folks, good thing we did that garden video because it's been raining here ever since. But we've got a big, beautiful Victorian style table to do for you right here on my take on Home and Garden. Now we showed you some of the stuff that we might want to use. We have this incredible Victorian style runner for today. Say for a rainy day and that's what we've got now. So we've got our basket, we've got our pine. Our pine acts as our oasis and keeps everything in. Now we're going to use flowers that you would see in the summer in a Victorian age in that flavor. So we've got some super hydrangeas. Really good. As always, I want to get my high center first, highest point in the arrangement. Let's go around. the tall piece. More hydrangea. We're going to take our fillers. Pink, pink cheek roses. And fill that around. We've got some mums. And we're going to feather them in as well. Basically Filling in, like you know, all the way around. Now we want to establish the length of the piece. We're going to come in here with a couple of ferns. And we're going to come out the ends to establish the overall length of the arrangement. We've got our basic form body of the arrangement and we're going to fill it in. But I want to get some certain colors in here and I want to Get plenty of hydrangea, which they would have used. Look at that. Now I want to come out the ends and exaggerate the shape of this basket. Cabbage rows, formal balance, one on each side. More peonies, Victorian favor. Get that color off, gone. Highlighter paste, we 
we're gonna, you'll notice we're st gonna start drifting off of complete formal balance, because we're not gonna worry about that 100%. And it's just a trick that makes it look more realistic. You can have formal balance, but it's not going to be perfect in nature uh, anywhere. pretty much stayed on point here but we're gonna throw it off like they did with these carnations and you think we had a color scheme but then they've just put in a, a loud color with them and for that style it just really works really works. Southern Magnolia. The place where it's going to go and take a look. I see we got a little tweaking. Heavy pink over here. A couple adjustments. Go with a little lavender here. Lavender is something they would certainly have in the garden and they would use everything they had available to make it special. like these little fillers. They make it look pro. Because it should be looking that way. Now here's our Victorian style centerpiece. And we're gonna move along with the table. Now we have a beautiful tablecloth, light pink in the damask style. And we're going with white chargers. Now folks, today we're using this Crown Ming Fine China Made in China. Next, dinner napkins with a gold napkin ring.
dinner fork, salad fork on the left. In that order. wine glass off the top of the night. Well folks, I think we've got it. Now, I'm going to show you all around. So folks, that's our Victorian style 12 seater dining table. Elegant as ever. And hopefully you liked our video. And if you did, follow us on Instagram. Give us a thumbs up. Like and share our video. And as usual folks, thank you for watching. The best subscribers going on. You know it. Right here. On my take on Home and Garden. Thank you. And be safe everybody. And we'll see you in the next video.